Hero. What's up? I'm home now, as you can see by the background. That is my room. And I have a message. I'm back in my bedroom, and it's good to be here. And uh, it was, Napa was fun, and San Francisco was awesome. And now I'm home. I've been here for a couple of days. It's hot. It's like 90 degrees outside or something. And, uh, yeah. And I'm uh, feeling good. Feeling good. And uh, I went swimming yesterday, which was a beautiful, the wet, the pool temperature was awesome. And uh, saw my bandmates yesterday. And uh, yeah. You know, when we get home, we're home. So as you can imagine, when we get off the road, we go into we're at home mode, which is that came out the wrong way. We're in home mode. And, um, and it feels good to, to sort of be off the road and, you know, have some time to not have to, like, be overloaded with being away. So, I've been um, getting settled. I did my laundry and cleaned up my room. Played with my dogs. Uh, played the piano, which was nice to actually have a piano. Um, what else have I been doing? Got a little, got a little snip, snipped it, and um, I saw Son of Rambo, by the way, in England. I'm gonna go see it again tomorrow with my brothers because it's the best. It's so good that movie. Play some tennis tomorrow. Um, and play some board. I played Balderdash last night, which was epic. Last night was an epic round of Balderdash, which if you don't know that game, I really suggest you go buy it. People like Taboo, as you know, I'm sure some of you love this game, but I highly recommend Balderdash for those of you who enjoy a creative game, as opposed to let's roll the dice and see what happens kind of game. This is a game where you control your own destiny. Like life, you can create things that are exciting. People will respond. Um, what else? Books. Um, I finished All My Sons by Arthur Miller. I'm, I'm getting really into plays. Really like plays. I read, uh, I've been, I finished my Sophocles collection, Antigone, Oedipus the King, and Electra, which I really recommend those, um, the Greek um, playwrights. I'm about to begin Inferno by Dante. And uh, what else did I buy? I bought Ham on Rye, which is a Bukowski book. I love Bukowski. Um, I, bought, um, I bought some other stuff. Let me go get my books. I'm about to begin these. Streetcar Named Desire, obviously. Tennessee Williams. Sweet Bird of Youth. Um... Bernard Shaw, Arms and the Man, A View from the Bridge, Arthur Miller, The Price, Arthur Miller. So, as you can see, I'm on a play, I'm in a play thing right now. I'm in a playful mood, no pun intended, am I right? Uh, yeah. And uh, I'm doing the Say Now updates, people are getting those, which is cool to do like I don't need my computer, I don't need internet, I can just communicate. So maybe I'll be in a situation where Say Now really comes in handy. And uh, yeah, that's it. Excited to uh, be home. It's been a long time. And then I'm going out, going out in June. And the run we just did was really great overall. It was a good package and nice to be out with people that are that are cool and good music. And um, I'm looking forward to continuing. Actually, I got a bicycle. 
It's a fold-out bike. It folds into a, like, not full-size bike. It's got, like, small wheels. But it folds into a bike you can ride around. So I got it at the fi at the last show on tour, and now I'm going to have it for the rest of this tour. So I'm going to be riding my bike a lot. Because when you show up to a place on tour, you, you're really stranded, unless you cab it somewhere. So now I have a bike to get me around these little towns we go to to enjoy, to ex to to explore. And that's that's all she wrote. I'm gonna go. All right, peace. Mm -hmm.